you need to often extract data from different layout elements, for example, the part area. Let's use fields to perform this kind of operation. The use of fields provides added flexibility as this makes it possible to manually insert created texts or tables. You need to select the Objects option in Field category when this command is enabled and select Object in Field Names. Then only object data will be displayed in the layout. Click the Select Object button to select the desired object. Data on the object is displayed on the property list. Select Expression to extract the existent expression for dimensional constraints. Select the Name option to extract the dimensional name. You can also select the Value option to extract the measurement value. After defining the displayed property, confirm this in the Configured Fields dialog box. You have to select the desired entity to extract the object area and select the Area option from the property list. If this data is inserted in a table, it is possible to extract the areas from all layout elements. Following that, use expressions to measure the total area of a part. Employ the same process for defining expressions such as on a spreadsheet. Let's measure the total area of the element to be fixed or attached. Insert some fields related to body areas and holes from the previously created table. In the last field, you inserted the following expression, B2 minus 2 times B3. This makes it possible for you to measure the final part area. The usage of fields is extremely useful in drawing parameterization, as fields automatically update when entity measurements are changed. So in this class, you have learned how to extract data from existent dimensional constraints to measure the area.